Hi everyone, it's Ballet and Junior here again, and I'm finally back filming another video for you all. We have another exciting opening video for you all today, as I have another package from Starlight Dance. Um, I believe there's two items in here, so these like similar items that I'm going to be able to review and like compare to each other to see which one suits me. Um, <clears throat> however, I do have the two in here, so I can see which ones fit different types of dancers so that way you guys are also getting the best recommendation from myself starlight and belly end so you can find the best product for you so we can all dance to our best ability so um i'm just going to plunge straight into this and yeah i can never remember how to open these um, Okay. So here's our first pair with the little starlight dance on them. These are leg warmers and these contain a stirrup here. So these are the stirrups leg warmers and I think they are like the slightly higher than your ankle length one. If that's not the right word, I don't know what is, but that's what they're reminding me. And then these ones, um, these are slightly different. These look quite funky. Um, yeah. So I think, I don't think. I think these are also designed to move your ankle. Yes. Um, okay, right, I remember now. Um, so yeah, these are 100% acrylic and they are a really soft material. They're quite thick as well, which means they're going to do a really good job of like keeping your ankles warm because look how thick that is. Like, how are you going to get cold through that? You know. So yeah, we have two pairs here, as you can see. Just make sure there's nothing open here. No, we're good. Um, two very, very different pairs of like, like warmers. So... I'm going to go away and I'm going to put them on and I'm going to come back and tell you guys how they are. So I'm back and I have the leg warmers on and I'm going to start by reviewing this one. So this is the one with the stirrup in it. Um, I've only got one on each leg, so um, yeah. Um, so it's tight at the top, which means it's going to keep the heat in the leg warmer. So this means like my ankles and my legs are going to stay nice and warm. But it's not too tight down here. This means I can move my foot freely without it being too tight. And I also have my Starlight Ballet shoes on, which means my foot's also going to be able to move more effortlessly. So, um, they're very warm. As soon as I put them on when I stood up, I could really feel my leg already getting warm and cosy. Um, you can kind of ruffle them up a little bit, or you can kind of take them slightly further up your leg. Like this. To warm your calf as well. Um, this is actually good because I get very bad cramps in my calves usually from time to time. Um, which means my legs aren't properly warm after doing ballet. So this is actually very good for me. So I actually really like these leg warmers. Um, and they're not too tight, so they're not strangulating my calf or anything. So these I'd give five out of five stars for because I think their design, their material and their fit is just all around amazing. Next up, we have the second kind of leg warmer. Um, I was a little bit confused as how to wear these ones. I figured you can wear them in a few different ways. Um, so you can just place it around your ankle and you can have it quite baggy around your ankle. It's got a very thick kind of um, tight, well, not too tight, but it keeps the heat inside to warm like your ligaments here, which is actually also good because I forgot to mention. On this side of my leg, I have pulled a muscle up here. So to dance in these, would be amazing because then it's keeping my muscles warm so I'm not going to injure anymore. Um so that's a thumbs up. Um and then it's got the same kind of tight fill up here and then lots of material around it which is the same kind of material as these ones to keep my leg nice and warm. So this is kind of like the first way I decided to wear it. And then I figured you could also take this around the ankle the heel I mean so you can have it like almost like a warm-up boot for your ankle your, your heel 
Well, your ankle on your heel, really. So, um, but I feel like this would probably get them dirty if you try to dance like this. So, I personally wouldn't wear them like this, but it's personal preference, obviously. And then, obviously, you can do the same as the other leg and you can pull them up. And then, yeah. Um, just due to the confusion and the, um, the band at the bottom, I probably give these a four out of ten as they do keep my legs warm, obviously, and they are going to help my muscle at the side here. But I prefer the stirrup as it's also warming the top of my foot. As through college, I have also pulled the top of my foot here. So these are just really keeping all my injuries here and all my pulled muscles warm. So I'm not going to injure myself anymore. These are also keeping certain parts of my legs warm, but it, these ones just give me more warmth all around really i think these would be great if you just decided to warm your ankles in a quick bar exercise or something and i still think these are absolutely amazing as these do actually also have a thicker material at the bottom and things like that but i don't quite prefer the um thick waistband going around my foot as i feel like it would be like an extra part of my belly shoe and i just prefer to have my star lights on so after a quick review i decided i preferred the stirrups black foot warmers and leg warmers as they give me the all around support of warming the top of my foot where I've pulled a muscle, the side of my leg where I've also pulled a muscle, as well as preventing cramps in my calves as they are also keeping my, cramp, my cramps away by keeping my calves warm. So this is why I personally prefer the steric ones. However, if you would prefer to just have a warm ankle and not really warm the top of your foot or like around your foot where the stirrups go then i definitely recommend these to you and if you're also looking for a bit of extra insulation then i'd recommend these as well as i think these are actually a thicker material than these ones and they're also very soft as well both of them they're very comforting and like they do keep the legs very warm um however if you are looking for like a little bit more room around the ankle and you don't really want a tight fit leg warmer then i'd also go with these ones as these have kind of like a ball going around as these ones don't so this is also providing more room so if you do have like larger ankles or larger calves then i would actually recommend these ones to you but personal preference for me i have quite medium like width legs but i also have quite small ankles and then quite a big like muscle on top of my foot so i would go with these ones like my body type but i recommend buying these actually like both of them because it might be one day you prefer this pair, one day you prefer that pair, depending on what you're kind of going for. So if you have like an injury and you kind of want a bit of tight fit, and I actually feel like these will actually provide you a bit of support, then I'd go with these ones. Whereas if you're just looking for a quick warm up, then go for these ones. I would definitely be taking these to college with me as I think they're absolutely amazing. Like they are so soft, they're so insulating and I can feel like they're going to do me a lot of good in my ballet. And not just ballet throughout my other elements such as tap, jazz, lyrical, contemporary. These are not just for ballet, these are across the board. So don't think that they're just for ballet just because I'm ballet as junior. So um, I hope you enjoyed my video and I really do hope that you all loved my review enough to go and buy yourself a pair of Starlight leg warmers. I definitely recommend them to you. Maybe experiment with a few pairs as they are not too expensive as Starlight are very well priced. And yeah. So I hope you enjoyed my video and I will be with you soon again with some more, hopefully, package opening videos and reviewing videos as well as some more exercises as I do have a bunch of exercises I'd love to share with you guys. So hopefully they will be out soon for you all and I can't wait to see you all again. Bye!